What's going on guys? My name is CPK and welcome back to another video. I'm super proud to announce that this video is sponsored by Skillshare. Skillshare is a massive online learning community with thousands of amazing, inspiring classes for creative and curious people. Skillshare gives you the opportunity to explore new skills that you've always wanted to try, expand on some of your existing passions, and to get lost in your own creativity. Skillshare has thousands of easily accessible courses spread across a whole range of topics, including photography, film and video, gaming, music production, marketing, and many, many more. One of the classes on Skillshare that I was personally super interested in was iPhone photography. The course is run by Amelie Zatska, who is well known for taking and editing all of her photos on her iPhone. This course is split up into 34 lessons that are broken down into easily digestible chunks, with most of the lessons actually being under five minutes long, meaning that this course and thousands of other courses on Skillshare can be broken down to fit into anyone's time schedule. Skillshare is made specifically for learning, meaning there are absolutely no ads and they're always launching new premium classes so that you can stay fully focused and follow wherever your creativity takes you. And Skillshare is less than $10 a month with an annual subscription. No matter what 2021 brings us, you can spend it creating something meaningful with Skillshare's online classes. Why not use this time to pursue a new passion or extend your knowledge in a field that you already love? I'm sure with Skillshare's thousands of classes, you can find inspiration in the moment and learn how to express your creativity. And thanks to Skillshare, the first 1,000 of my subscribers to click the link in the description will get a free trial of Skillshare's premium membership so that you can explore your creativity. Thanks again to Skillshare for sponsoring this video. There's so many courses I'm going to look into myself personally. But for now, let's get back into the regular video. What's going on, you guys? My name is CPK. Welcome back to another episode of X Life and potentially one of the most exciting episodes we've ever done. So I recently heard that our very own Joel is putting Jeremyism up for grabs. No, 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 it's not on the market. He's not selling it. The only way to take over Jeremyism is to complete the Jeremyism House of Pain, which is a set of challenges that Joel has created essentially to politely murder the people on the server. The prize, if you win, is that you become the leader of Jeremyism. That's the best thing that could ever happen. I could choose what to do with it. And quite frankly, if I if I die in this, if I lose, I will leave Jeremyism forever. I'll leave. I am confident in my abilities. I mean, despite not knowing what's actually in this, um, I watched part of Joel's video to find out where to go and then turned it off for complete fairness. And if I die, I die. Uh, so it should be good fun. But then I want to do something later to de-stress. And I believe Lizzie is having a little horse race. So I'm going to go and take part in that as well. Um, so even if I do die, maybe that'll be more relaxing. Who knows? Maybe it'll also mean death. I know what Lizzie's like. Without further ado, let's head over to Joel's area where we're going to try whatever this house of pain may throw at us. Ah, Jeremyville. It's been a while. I haven't been here for a very long time, honestly. I mean, technically, I came to Lizzie's area not that long ago. And I actually think this is where we're doing the horse race later, so I'll be back again. I've gone from never being here to being here all the time. Ah, Jeremyism is rad. True. True. Guys, if you're watching this video, go ahead and leave a like. It will really help soften the blow when I inevitably die and become one of the only nine hearters on the server. <laughs> uh, so please leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you're new. Loads of cool stuff coming very soon. Uh, let's find this house. Where Where is it? Okay, so I think it's over this bridge. And behind Joel's actual house. I think I was actually right next to it <laughs> when I when I came in on this thing. Ah, yes. How could I have missed this? Absolute travesty. What is this? These wither plants. Or oh, these black plants. I'm, I don't know. But I'm very, very scared of them. Okay. It's, there's no danger to you get to the house, right? I don't think. Hello? Jeremy's house of pain. It sounds pretty terrifying, doesn't it, to be fair? It sounds pretty terrifying. Okay, rules. All right, all right. Jeremy's House of Pain, the rules. Deposit everything you have on you in the crate, including all armor, elytra, etc. You cannot enter with any potion or food effects on you. Well, there goes that idea. Well, we'll put that away. No breaking any blocks, items, or anything in general. And you only have two attempts. If you fail twice, you cannot try again. I guess that stops someone with lots of lives repeatedly just trying it so they can take over Jeremyism. Because I think there's some people who'd want to get rid of Jeremyism, can you believe? Disgusting, really. Wait, has someone completed this already? There's a bunch of stuff already in this chest, and I'm very confused as to why there's stuff in here. I'll just, I guess I'll just put my stuff separate up top. You can see here that these clothes give me zero armor protection, so I don't have to take them off, I'm sure. Like, they don't, they don't do anything. It's just cosmetic. I'm going to leave them on. 
Let's get in the zone. How do I know when it starts? I know, I know what Joel's like. I'm like, wait. Oh, well, here's, here's my main issue is that you guys can probably see just underneath me if I move this way. Oh, no, this way. You can see that I have the subtitles on down here in the, in the bottom corner. All right, I have the subtitles on, which means I can see the words lava pops and I can hear it. I know there's lava somewhere, but it's just like a point of no return. Oh, uh, okay. We're in. Um, interesting. The door's already open. Uh, is this cheating? I feel like this may be cheating. I mean, just to clarify here, uh, I would have known this. What's inside the windmill? I wouldn't have known this, honestly. But both of them are pulled. So whoever else went first didn't know either. Interesting. <laughs> well, we, we go. Congratulations, you have shown that you are wise, but are you skilled? I'm a little suspicious of this, I'll be honest. I mean, no one said I couldn't just walk all the way through. What's going to happen? Is that going to... I don't want to set a trap. To, oh, no. Oh, no. Wait, is that going to hit me again, though? I'm so stupid. I should have just gone through. Yep. I should have gone through. What is this? Parkour? Ooh. Okay. Oh, I'm on half a heart. That's not good. <laughs> okay. Parkour. We can, we can do parkour. 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 Okay. We can do this. It's just one jump. It's just one jump. It's just one jump. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh my goodness. This is a very harsh colored signals. Obviously, you are skilled, but are you accurate? Okay, so dropper. There's the... Well, that must be the way you go, right? Obviously, you're skilled, but are you accurate? And I have to do the dropper. I'm getting a bit nervous now. I'm getting a little bit nervous now. But it's just it's just one, one jump. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. I can do this. This half a heart business is not nice. I'll be honest. It's really not nice. I'm getting a bit stressed. I'm getting stressy. I have a little sweet in front of me from earlier. Mm. Mm. Shall we do it? I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it. I'm going to go. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. I'm going. <gasps> oh. <laughs> I feel sick. Please take your sword and shield before moving on. Okay. They're the swords and shield. They're in the thing at the start. Have people already finished this? Or do people die here? Okay. If I get hit once, I'm dead. This is the problem. Okay, this is good. Okay, timing, timing, timing. Okay, one dead. One's dead, one's dead, one's dead. <laughs> He's a hater. <laughs> Wait, they don't respawn, right? Did it respawn? If they don't respawn, I think I've, I've, I've finished this part. Okay. Now what? Netherrack? Wait, does the shape that these are in mean something? Kind of looks like a funky number four. A sideways T? What is that, though? Oh, my God. They don't mean anything. They don't mean anything. They don't mean anything. Honestly, that's embarrassing. <laughs> Damn, I thought too much of Joel, huh? Oh no, so someone beat you here. Tough luck. At least you finished. I can't give you Jeremyism, but as a reward, I will be your servant for a week. I'll build, collect, or do anything you want. Please don't be too mean. I did not just do all of this to not get Jeremyism. I am furious. Are you joking me? I just risked my life. Who beat me? Who did it? I need to know who did it. I'm so sad. Oh my goodness. I am blown away. I am in shock and awe. I have earned Jeremyism. Whoever won it, split it with me. Who did it? Holy moly. I mean, if nothing else, guys, are you proud of me? I mean, that was pretty impressive, right? So that means those people who had swords and shields here did do it. Ah, oh, I'm disappointed. Who else would have beat it? I wonder who would have won. Who would have done that? Maybe Scott? I heard that Jimmy tried. But I heard it also didn't go very well. So I don't think it would have been Jimmy. I think Scott probably would have tried to do it so that he could get rid of Jeremyism. 
And if Scott's the leader, I don't want to be in Jeremyism. Let me tell you that much, all right? Because I know Scott does not like Jeremyism. He never has. Despicable. Well, all that hard work and we get, well, we get Joel as a slave for a week. That's still pretty good. What weird challenges can we have Joel do? What, what can we get Joel to build us? Uh, perhaps I'll get him to dress up as a cat maid and he can just follow me around for a day. That'd be pretty solid. Right, well, that was incredibly stressful. I think it's time to move on to something a little less stressful, which I think is happening over here, honestly. Uh, so I'm going to head over there, see if my friends are around, and uh, let's go try and take on a horse race. Can I be a back-to-back -back winner of things today? Am I just in a winning mood? I think I might be. All right, oh, welcome to the race, the horse race <clears throat> that you will all be partaking in. Yay! Woo! Woo! Today, Yay! you will be competing for the... Horse Girl Award. Oh, yeah. You are all boys. Wow. Oh, my God. Amazing. Horse Girl. That looks like something off of, like, Facebook. A Facebook award. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so there are not a lot of rules. Um, just no cheating. Oh, <laughs> you hear my horse? I'm putting, I'm putting him in the lasso. I'm putting him in. I'll do it. I didn't hit anything. Oh. Let me are, are you allowed to hit other people's horses? That no, okay. Mean... No interfering with other contestants. Okay, good. No flight rings, no rugs, no Elytra, <laughs> no flying. Basically, you have to stay on your horse. The only time you're allowed off your horse is if your horse meets an unfortunate end for some mysterious reason that I cannot foresee, or... If your horse kind of falls off the track, you can lasso it and put it back on the track where you fell off, if that makes sense. <laughs> what are the rules of lassoing our opponent's horses? <laughs> Whoa. You cannot do that. Obviously, right, cool. that falls Good. under rule one. Do not interfere with the other yeah, opponent. Sorry, there's a lot of rules. I forgot the first rule immediately, pretty uh, much. I have a pretty <laughs> important question. Yeah. Um, yep. Let's say theoretically everything you owned has burned in a house fire. Um, if my horse died, what do I do? <laughs> I have nothing else. Run. Especially Can't not another horse. <laughs> No, wait, that's my backup horse. Give him that. Give him... Well, then put it in your lasso. He, he's in my lasso. I just got him out. For... You're saying you don't have a backup horse. I, I have I don't nothing. Have a horse. Trust I in your horse. horse. Trust in him. Trust in him. Oh, it's him I trust. Mm. It's me I don't. What's your horse? Your right, horse okay. doesn't even have a name. It does. Look at, look at my name. It's a sick name. I'm, I can't see it. Oh, fun believable. Oh, that's a good yeah. name. Yeah. That's, yeah, yeah name yours doesn't have a name while you're on it. You know oh, what? Yeah. This, this name oh, is what I would call a horse if I ever Lovely had a horse, horse to horse race. Yeah, Lizzie, I have a question. If yeah. I happen to light the grass on fire <laughs> and someone's horse happens to run into it, does that count as interference? You're asking for a disqualification, John. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. I'll put the flint still away. Okay, one thing I forgot to mention is that whoever has my favorite horse gets a slight head start. Okay. Oh! Mount so up. everybody please mount up and I will make my choice. Oh my! Oh, man. Whoa. Right. Quick. That's, that's the horse. Right. Fwip's no. compensating oh for God. something. <laughs> I was about to say that. Wait, wait, wait. That one's my one as well, actually. <laughs> I don't have that. No, they're teaming. They're teaming. <laughs> yeah, I'll split the prize. Right, I'll get back on mine. Where is he? Uh, okay. Majority, you came with a reindeer too. Yeah. Is that allowed? Well, that's not a horse. Lizzie. I'd say that's unoriginal for those two and no, it should go I to the bison. I say you could come on something other than a horse, but it, it, the <laughs> horse is built for horses. Okay, so jump. undoubtedly my favorite horse has to be Fwip's Bouflon. So <laughs> Fwip, you in fact get a slight head start. If you'd like to go uh, just ahead of the starting <laughs> point here. He can't get in. Can that, oh, can that oh, fit through the oh, He's oh. in. No, ahead of the starting point. He can't go ahead of it. He can't get out. He can't get out. Uh, he can't no, uh, one sec. I just go ahead, go ahead yeah. now. Yo, gonna... if he gets a head start, we're not getting past him. <laughs> <laughs> I, don't, I don't know about that. You, right. don't, you haven't seen the full of the cost. You, basically, you win when you cross the finish line, okay? okay. One lap. How, one one lap, lap five laps. Should we? It's one lap. One okay. lap. Okay. Oh my gosh, I'm so mm -hmm. Best of five or? Um, okay. Oh my god. One I'm, lap. I'm assuming we can <laughs> jump. We, we can. We can jump everything, yeah. right? Yeah. If yeah, you, you can jump. Okay. If you can if jump. If you can jump, yeah. Good luck, if you can. <laughs> Good luck, everybody. Bye. All right, so welcome to okay, the horse I'm race, start the guys. Countdown. Let's get ready. We need to win. Marks. We need to win. Three, two, one, go. Go. Oh, it's an unclear oh. lead at first. Wait a second. Ollie's taking a storming lead. Nobody saw this coming. Oh, God, I can't get out. Okay, He's go. got the horse with the legs. Oh, he's actually got one I of mean, the slowest horses. they all have horses. legs. Okay. But his particularly. Catch Ollie, into catch Ollie. Oh, oh my, my gosh. god! They're going underground. But will they oh, all no. make it? Uh, uh, go. I want to win have so a few much. stragglers back here. Wait, is it this way? <laughs> Whip 
And Jimmy really uh, uh. struggling still at the start here. This is embarrassing. Let's see who is the first to emerge from the underground section. Uh, it's me. It's CPK. And off uh, he goes, snaking no. the across the path. Yeah. Wow. Uh, <gasps> oh, what wow. are shortcuts? What is, oh, he's scared. And he's he's gone to the rainbow section. The rainbow hurdles. Look at him go. I'm flying. <laughs> Parkour okay, Warrior. CPK has a clear lead. Look at this. Wait a second. Parkour this looks Warrior. a little cheaty, but I'm going to allow it. <laughs> Hole in the wall. Oh my God. Go, go, go. We can and do it. We can do straight. it. Storming ahead of the others. But oh, can he I love out this. The this is sick. <laughs> yes. Oh, he's got it. We're going. There he goes. <laughs> Go, go, and he's go, off go. onto the home stretch. Home stretch. Oh my! I've done it already. I'll and start nobody doing it. else is even close behind him. <sighs> Flip has now changed from his boot blonde <sighs> to a regular horse and somehow overtaken the pack. <sighs> go, go, go. Looks like everyone's really struggling oh, on right. the rainbow hurdles here. <sighs> I'm scared. Somehow, be traps. Joey and Scott have fallen into last place. Is this it? Are we gonna do it? Are we gonna win? CPK is actually taking the horse backwards now. He's just flexing on it, the other horses. <laughs> He's scared. He's scared. Come on. With no sign of competition <laughs> in sight. People are not doing okay, too great at all. Ollie crossing the ice bridge. People are not doing too Which hot at this. Where will he go? He's taking the left route. If he's on the left route, that's pretty close to me, actually. I think I've already won. Have I won? I think I've won. I actually think I won. Is CPK about to finish? Is CPK about to finish the race? He's doing it backwards, and he's done Whoa! it. He's done it backwards. That's CPK in first Whoa! place. Brian Sam coming up in second Let's place. Go! He's fallen off his horse. <laughs> what is he doing? He hasn't taken his horse across the finish line. He hasn't technically finished the race. <laughs> okay, he's technically finished the race now. Where is everyone else? Oh, Scott has taken a storming lead ahead of the pack in third place with his reindeer, followed by oh, Flip. Oh, look at this. It's getting close. close one. Everyone else is so close together. There he goes across the finish line, followed by oh, Flip. Wait. Wait a second. <laughs> wait a second. Oh, no. <laughs> Who could have seen this coming? Joel overtaking Flip at the last second as he tries to mount his bouflon to the finish line. <laughs> it's like the wacky races. <laughs> <laughs> it's like wacky races. <laughs> Where is everybody else? Where are the rest of our wacky racers? Seriously, where are they? Joey is still on the ice bridge. I believe he's the last one. No, wait, Jimmy. Jimmy is nowhere to be seen. Strong win there for us. Strong win. Good commentary from Lizzie there as well. Absolutely smashed it, guys. Oh, there he goes. Joey across the finish line. Joey did start on a reindeer. Yes, it seems he's gotten his backup horse out. And here comes Jimmy, slowly. <laughs> Poor Jimmy. <laughs> Here he comes. He's still finishing the race. It's Jimmy in last place. Yay. Well done, Jimmy. That's my boy. They cannot be how boy. fast your horse goes. What on hey, earth a, was that? Give me a second. Give me a second. Let's just kill him. Let's, let's, let's kill him. No. He's got to go. Lame. Did you He's see lame. that performance? <laughs> Did you see it? Oh, oh my goodness. He oh, injured his ankle and solidarity gun. took him out. That was horrendous. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Well, the winner of the one and only horse race is CPK. Yeah. yeah. Woo. Woo. Like, oh, my God. Not having a house to put your horse word up in. Well, oh, that's yeah, that's a really good point. I, I need yeah, to build a new house. <laughs> hey. Oh, lovely horse. Do we get um, participation awards? Yeah, do I get a second place no. prize? Yeah. Because that's quite good for someone that doesn't ever play Minecraft. No. Guys, we did it. I had great confidence in us winning a horse race. And now I have this lovely horse girl award, which is going to look wonderful in my absolutely destroyed house. Uh, I think next episode, probably time to build somewhere new to live, isn't it? Probably time to build somewhere new to live. So give me like a week because I want to make a ridiculous house, all right? I want to do something really cool. So I'm going to need some time. I want you guys to be as excited as possible to see the new house that I'm going to build. It's not going to be here. I'm going to leave this as the remnants. And me and Jack are still going to interrogate people to find out what happened. Don't you worry. But for now, guys, I'm going to leave this episode here. Thank you so much for watching. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. If you have, please leave a like and subscribe to the channel if you're new. I've been CPK and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.